Glad to have you aboard here, Sam. Hi, Matt. This is our question. What is that? Uh, what is it? It looks like an inverted triangle with a line on top. Uh, do you have any further insight? Yeah, well, the line on top is a vector, okay, and I'm yeah. we're going to define it in three dimensions in a rectangular coordinate system. Okay. And I'll use blue here. <clears throat> So, uh, in three dimensions, a vector has three components. Mm -hmm. And we just have to fill it in. Okay. So, we could put A, B, C. That sounds easy enough to me. But it's not, a, it's not as easy as A, B, C or oh. 1, 2, 3. Darn. It's going to be this. D, D, Y. D, D, Z. Okay. So, normally when we have these partial derivatives, we have something that's getting differentiated, and here there's nothing. Mm -hmm. So this is like, it's not, it's some incomplete. So these are operations waiting to be done. Okay, so this triangle thing is an operator that can act on other mathematical entities? Yeah, and we'll show an example uh, in a minute, but I want to really underscore what this means. So I have this old way of writing it. Hey! Oh, what's the minus? That's his mouth. Oh, that's his mouth. That's his beard. It's <laughs> <laughs> Black man has got a beard. I, I guess uh, <laughs> anyone hey, well, gets old. Let's make it a real beard. Okay, so that looks very much like fun. It's Pac-Man. Oh, it's multiple Pac-Man. It's it, multiple You're not going easy on the ghost, are you? No, this is like... I'm sure you've played with uh, video games that have Pac-Man in it. Did uh, you? I'm sure I have. <laughs> or is that too long ago and far away? Yeah, I'm not that, that young. There. So what did I do? Well, this emphasizes the fact that we're waiting to eat something and the eating will be consisting, the digestion will be differentiating. Mm. So we can give an example. Let's, let's give an example. Uh, let's assume that what we want to operate on is a scalar field. Scalar field, okay. Okay, so say the height of a mountain range above sea level. So H is the mountain range, and uh, there it is. Okay, so, so the altitude at any point x, y. Right, so okay. this is going to be a function of just two variables, so some function of x and y. Mm -hmm. So let's, in order to operate on this, we just stick it in. Okay, so Pac-Man X, Pac-Man Y, and Pac-Man Z. Right. Each would uh, would, would uh, digest this function of X and Y and differently. The, yeah, and the digestion means take the derivative. So this mm. one is really easy. The Z derivative of a function of X and Y is zero, mm -hmm. and then we can write it in abbreviated form like this. So that means if we apply this to a terrain map, for example, a uh, height of a mountain range above sea level, mm -hmm. this operation will be resulting with that final result. Okay, so the change in height in the x direction, the change in height in the y direction, and you put together and it, it's some sort of vector. Yeah, it's a vector. Mm -hmm. Hey, that's kind of weird. We started with a scalar, mm -hmm we operated by a vector and we ended up with a vector. But yeah. that has, we know that. If you take a, an ordinary numerical vector and multiply it by a number, you get a vector. Mm -hmm. And here we're taking a scalar and multiplying it by a vector and we get that. 
Okay, so this operator business is not uh, that scary of a business. No, and, and you must remember one thing, that Pac-Man only eats in one direction. So, oh. yeah, so, so what would, here's a little test here, what would this look like? Hmm. So, uh, look at the Pac-Man. This F is in front. Mm -hmm. Can't get at the stomach. So you're just going to get... So this time F is chasing the Pac-Man. F is chasing the Pac-Man, so you're just going to get, in simple terms... And in 3D, we'll get that. Mm -hmm. So it's another operator. It's a vector operator. This one ends up as a vector. Mm. This one is still this a vector. This still has to operate on something else. Yeah, so basically what you do it is you're putting some nice thing in front of the Pac-Man, but it's still waiting to digest something in mm -hmm. this case. What do you think? You think you can do more with this? Uh, what about some graphical intuition, if possible? Let's this is, do uh, getting a bit much. Let's do graphical intuition, and we'll start with the gradient.